Speaking of which, school will be back in session next month, and here at WDHN, we've been informing you about Wiregrass School District's reopening plans. Robert Smith joins us live with Henry County Schools' latest plans. What's the news, Robert? Good evening, Paige. The Henry County School Board held a meeting tonight, and while I was there, I talked to Superintendent Chris Padgett, and he said while COVID-19 is effective, students, you may cringe when you hear this, there will still be class lectures next month. Although COVID is showing no signs of backing off, the school year is right around the corner and Henry County Schools will be welcoming its students back with open arms. First day of school for the uh, students is going to be August 21st. And uh, we're looking forward, I know the teachers are looking forward for the students and the students are looking forward to, to the, seeing the teachers and students are looking forward to seeing other students. With schools beginning in a pandemic, there will be quite a few changes in the school year for students. Students that ride a bus, they'll go directly to the room instead. You, we usually have a, a waiting area and we're going to do away with that. Gonna, you know, when the teachers get there, the teacher's going to go to the room and, and the student's going to go directly to that, that teacher's room. Henry County School Superintendent says when students enter their school, you can expect hand sanitizer dispensers to help prevent or avoid the spread of sickness. Teachers will also be going through professional development a few days before the start of school, which they will be taught how to disinfect their room. If parents are not comfortable sending their child to school next month, the school system is offering virtual learning. The state has given us uh, the school elastic uh, um, base front and then we have schools PLP which is actually going to be the curriculum. And I think access is also going to be in, in, in the school elastic program too. And this is going to be a little bit different than what they experienced in the in the spring when they got because in the spring we basically did all hard copies and grades were given as far as um, what their third nine weeks or or um, if there was semester what they you know first semester and third nine weeks. Also to mention Paige, virtual students will have to go to the school to take their tests and extracurricular activities are still on as of now with social distancing guidelines. Well, we know one thing for sure, this school year will look different no matter what schools decide yeah. to do. Thanks, Robert.